Hello, buddy, and um, I'm back with another tutorial review. Um, this time this is a forgotten toy review. So um, I'm really excited because I've been forgotten this figure for like a few years. Um, this is probably one of my like first happy meal or kids meal like um like fast food toys i ever had so um why not just stick in because it's my first one it's kind of forgotten a little bit but um, i'm starting to get digging it a little and the figure we're reviewing is the bear nut figure now bear nut is like a show so um I'm from Indonesia, so I know the show, but, um, if you guys, like, if you, if, like, there is no such show in America, I'm just gonna re-review this thing in Indonesia, so, um, guys, maybe just comment on something, I don't know, but anyway, we'll take a look at Bear Not the Bear, with treadmill. Alright, now first up, let's take a look at the accessories. Now I I kind of want to review this Batman figure here, but um I kind of want to try and review the um forgotten Bear Nut the Bear figure. So um first up, let's take a look at the accessories and that this any accessories are. Hang on, it's not shown on camera, so I'm just gonna show it. It's treadmill, treadmill, treadmill. I don't know how you pronounce that. Because, again, I'm an Indonesian people, but I could speak English as well. Now, Bear Not the Bear is actually not this, like, sloppy. Um, Over the f past few years, there some slops gotten in, like, Pink Pain got it. So, um, yeah, I don't really remember how the original detail looks like, but, um, yeah. It's very sloppy over the years. But, um... Because this is my first, like, I'm sorry, like, one of the first, like, um, fast food toys. Let's just dig in. So, this thing is kind of good. It kind of looks like a normal treadmill. Now, there are, like, little pick holes here. As you can see here, there is pick holes here. And then there is some pigs. Oh, and full stop, let me try to focus on the key. As you can see there, there are the numbers that a real treadmill has. It says 8888, eight, 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 the up and down, the green, red, and blue buttons, and some other buttons. Um, And it sort of just slides down. It doesn't really set what it is. It's just like lines. But um, who would want to like test a treadmill that quick i could see why the bear the me the bear not the bear show is like a really wacky and fun show now there's a reason why it has pick holes but um, i'll show you later you can pick this in yeah so i'll show you with the um later but for now let's focus on the articulation the head is on a swivel the arms are on a swivel. Now the legs, I'm pretty sure they're in okay articulation. But I guess it's because, again, over the years, the joints have started to loosen up, as you can see here. Now the way that you pick it is that it has pick holes. So let me try to get it down here. So it naturally... It won't really balance. Here, let me show you what I mean. Yeah. So you're going to need a support stand or something in between those lines. And that you could attach like the treadmill in. But this is not like a diorama type display. Because as you can see here, let me try to get the focus again. The um, little moving portions on the treadmill actually move. And there is this wind-up that actually sort of moves it front and back. So, it, so bear not the bear would sort of just move. Um, I don't really remember.
remember how the feature goes but this is a good feature i guess but again over the years things got really bad so um i'm just gonna show you how to attach this because kids might not understand take holes but yeah they're really stupid i mean why can't they understand peg holes? Um, at the end, there's also not pegs, but peg holes. And here at the holding portion, there is um a peg, two peg holes. Now, all you need to do is just place the legs in, and you're done. That's it. Bill not continue his activity in stop motion, if you want to. But... He's still pretty loose and he will not balance because again because he'll let me show. the pair calls a little bit too big so you're going to have to need some extra like help so again just attach the legs in it's really simple and then just attach the peg holes into the pegs and pretty much you have a pail nut now it's meant to like move but yeah this is not a diorama piece this is like a a fast food toy so yeah but over the years it has becoming a diorama display now now the next review, just in case you guys want to know, is a Batman figure. You can see here. Very detailed. But the detailing on Bill Not the Bill, I don't really remember, but the treadmill is still the same and it's very, very detailed. But um I'm gonna skip the details because the slow slops getting throughout the years. And um because of how much use I had it, but yeah, it's very, very white. Now, I'm not sure what type of bear bear nut is. But I'm guessing he's a polar bear because of, like, his whitish color. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So, yeah. And the action feature is, once again, a, hang on, a wind up. So, you just need to wind this up. But I don't know why over the years it failed. But it's a very, very unique toy. Now I'm not going to do a size comparison because all of my toys are out. Because um, I'm not going to tell you why because it's a secret to my family. Yep. But anywho, this is a great, great, great figure. And um, I don't really remember which fast food toy it is. Um, it's either like McDonald's or KFC or something. So, yeah, that's actually the end of this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below, and I'll see you next time. So, goodbye. Love you.